Good morning. So I'm having a low energetic week and I've been digging into truth, like basically looking at the Bible, what does it say about truth? And one of my verses that I picked out, I'm actually just gonna grab my book here and just read it. It's from John, um, nope, it's from 1 John. And it's verse 318, uh, Dear children, let us not love with words or speech, but with actions and in truth. And I'm focusing on the actions and in truth. Um, I think that that's kind of a carryover from yesterday's where, uh, where Jesus is basically showing us to focus on like what we should be doing instead of don't do this, don't do that. So I'm looking at loving in action and in truth. And so what does it look like to love in action and in truth? And I, I know often when I think of like, oh, I, I need to go love people, you know, I think like, oh, I should bring them a meal and I should, you know, all, all these things that are nothing more than making my busy mom to-do list grow even longer. That I'm like, I can barely keep my own family fed. I'm supposed to like, go feed them too, like, uh, blah, you know? So I, I don't know what, you know, let me know in the comments below what if, you know, what you think of that, if you're, if that's, you know, if that's on target with you, if you're like, oh my gosh, yeah, me too. Or if you're like, no, I'm pretty, I got it together. I can, you know, I can easily, um, you know, scrape a little bit more together for somebody else. Um, Although I'm not really talking about just a single portion. I'm talking about like, you know, bringing a meal to someone. Anyhow, I digress. Um, loving in action and in truth. So I guess for me, I'm finding I got to focus on like the truth, the being, the, the doing will come, but just the being. So for me to be kind, for me to be gentle, um, to be patient and to make it be less about like, oh, I gotta do this, I gotta do that. It's one more thing for me to do. Um, I'm just trying to think here. Uh, as you can tell, oh, I know. So, as I've said, I'm having a low energetic week. So, for me, what that looks like this week. I like the whole being, like how does that fit with me? It means to be restful, to understand that it's going to take me some time. It's gonna take me longer to do things. That's okay. Um, for me to understand that I'm going to need to eat healthier. That's also okay. Um, i trying to think, cause those are more like doing and, but less, you know, less about being, but But it's just being gentle to myself, really. The whole thing it encompasses being gentle and kind to myself and giving me what I need. Because if I don't have what I need, then I can't give it to other people. I can't give what I don't have. And I know that's a common thing with us busy moms that we often, we often don't give ourselves what we need or we think yeah you know, we think that we think it's selfish and it's really not um so i'm gonna wrap this up and i will see you tomorrow